Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for August 31st. So keep in mind that the timing is fluid, and this reading is not sign specific. So this reading may or may not be for you. This is just a daily energy that I am picking up on. Remember that this could resonate at any time in the next few days or, you know, the next week. Okay? So what do we got? Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe, what do we have? Huh. The fool reverse. So this is somebody that may be foolish. Somebody may be acting foolishly. They may be naive. They could be they could be taking risks that they shouldn't be taking. Um, that's what I see. That's what I see. I see this as somebody that or, you know, it could be the fact that somebody is afraid to take a risk maybe they're naive and they're too afraid to take a risk that's what this is we got somebody here that is afraid to take a risk imagine that afraid afraid to start over or afraid to do something afraid of the unknown right hmm. Ooh. The chariot reverse. So, yeah, we got somebody here that is not mastering their emotions. Fear is in the way. Look at that shit. Absolutely. We got somebody here that's fearful. Yep. Definitely. Not taking control. Okay. There's a lack of discipline. There's a loss of self. There's a lack of willpower here. This person is letting fear get in the way of victory. Okay. Fear is in the way of victory. Oh my God. The devil reverse. Now these are all majors. These are all majors. So there's something, it's like there's a major change that is needed, but fear is in the way. Fear is absolutely in the way. Somebody is need, need, needing to take back control. They need to break free from an unhealthy situation. But in order to do that, they're going to have to take the lead. Hmm. Breaking free from an unhealthy situation. But not doing so. Wow. 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 And I'm saying it because these are this is major. It's huge. Major, major, major. One. Major, major, major. Okay? This is uni the universe is trying to get somebody to have a new beginning. This is a major new beginning. They're trying to get somebody to learn some sort of lesson. And this lesson has to do with inner strength. It has to do with willpower. It has to do with making big, bold moves. There's an opportunity for success. But in order to get this success, you are going to have to make a move. My advice is to make that move. Whatever move is that you are that right now, right now, you know what I'm talking about, right? You absolutely positively do. You know what I am talking about, but fear is in the way. Face your fears head on. Take back control of your life. Get in the driver's seat. Take the reins away from whoever it is that has control over you, please. If it's fear, if it's your own fear, take back control. Find that willpower and that discipline to take the lead in your own life, to be your own boss. Don't let some outside force, which is probably fear, get in the way. Ego, pride, whatever. It's time for your new beginning. It's time to break free. It's time to break free from your fears. I'm serious. There's an, there's an opportunity for success here. There's a whole new world waiting for you. 
But one of our life lessons is finding inner strength. And somebody has given, they don't have it. It's like they don't have the strength to steer their life in the direction that they want it to go. You have the ability to steer your life in any direction. But if you want to let somebody else take that, take the reins, well, hey, <laughs> you're foolish. That's very foolish. So anyway, we have a major new beginning here. It's time to complete. It's time to complete this cycle. Okay? You gotta stand up for yourself. You gotta stand your ground. You gotta protect yourself. You gotta do what's right for you. Push everybody aside that doesn't support you. And that is no joke. Unless you got unless you're really worried about what everybody else is gonna say. Well, that's your ego talking. Yep, somebody is hindering their own success. It's like they're blocking, blocking success, blocking a new beginning, blocking completing a cycle. Come on now. Why? Feeling guilty? Somebody is feeling guilty for following their own path? No confidence. Somebody is lacking confidence. Thinking negatively. We got somebody here that is very pessimistic. Afraid. Afraid to start over. Afraid to start over. It's time. It is time to face your fears and step into unknown territory. My advice for today is to communicate your truth. So perhaps today is a day of, of communicating, of communicating your truth or hearing the truth from somebody because the devil reverse, somebody may find the strength within them to take back control. This is the sword of power. Take back control of your life, please. Speak. Speak. Somebody may decide finally to take a new approach. To be honest. To be truthful. This is a sort of truth. It's a sort of power. Somebody may finally wake up and decide to communicate their truth. Somebody is letting fear get in the way of a successful new beginning. From the first card to the last card. There's an opportunity to start on a new journey that could lead to success. But if you don't face your fears, <laughs> you're going to continue to lose yourself. You're going to continue to feel depressed. You're going to continue to block your success. You're, continu you're going to continue to feel down. You're going to continue to feel defeated. We're going to get one of these. It's a day of communication. It's a day of communicating. It's a day of truth. It's a day of awakening. Okay? Somebody is going to communicate the truth. I don't know who it is. Obviously, somebody is and somebody isn't. Because we got somebody here that is weak. We do. We have somebody here that is weak. It's like the universe, like I said is trying to get somebody to step into unknown territory, to step over the edge, to start over. They're trying to get somebody to, you know, complete an old cycle in their life. But free will plays a part. The universe can only push as, as much as it can. And there's opposition here. We have somebody here that is like fighting this change. Fighting the truth. Wild, wild, yikes.
There is a wild, untamed spirit inside of you, desperate to be unleashed. Free it and claim the gifts of energy, power, passion, and creativity it offers you. Through suppressing your wild, succulent, outrageous, and untamed self, you dull your senses and crush your creativity. You shrink, lose your energy, and become depressed. Your relationships suffer and your rage grows. You become ashamed, hostile, cold, boring, over-serious, and scared. You stop taking chances and live in mediocrity, constantly trying to protect yourself. The truth is that no one can judge you, punish you, or hurt you as much as you can. Give in to your wildness and stop living a sham. This part of you is sensual, provocative, truthful, courageous, bold, passionate, and alive. Set it free. This is a card of freedom. It's reversed. It's time to fly. Make the big, bold move. Good luck.